and we have different types of corrosion okay different types of corrosion there are basically eight types right basically eight types uniform corrosion pitting corrosion transgranular or intergranular exfoliation stress corrosion revised corrosion galvanic corrosion and erosion right so these are those eight types erosion right erosion in the sense so when this corrosion started how this uh, surface would be eroded right so erosion is a significant phenomena but it has some effect in the corrosion also so corrosion is different and erosion is different right corrosion by erosion occurs in moving media this type of corrosion is related to the flow speed of the fluid so when you see in a conducting of metal right metal tube or pipe if the liquid is flowing it can be water or some oil or hot gases right if they are flowing then it will lead to the corrosion by erosion right corrosion by erosion which is related to the flow speed of the fluid right? so how fast the uh, fluid is flowing is dependent it leads to local thinning right this is thinning don't assume thinking it's thinning thinning means getting thin air and thin right so if you have a metal tube of this thickness after undergone this type of corrosion this will get thin okay this will get thin in shape it's so this is meant by thinner okay so it leads to local thinning of the metal which results in scratches so these are scratches you know what is a scratch is right so a kind of rough surface gullies right and undulations right gullies and undulations they are something like this on the surface of the metal which are always oriented in the same direction namely the follow direction so if the flow is towards this region i mean this side the erosion is also in this region in this direction right which are always oriented in the same direction namely the flow direction so this a uh, thinning of metal due to the scratch gully and undulation is also similar to the direction of the flow right if the flow is in this way these effects will also in this way if the flow in the opposite opposite way these effects will also in the opposite way right so this is what called the corrosion by erosion uh so the reason for this is it can be hot gas okay hot gas it can be hot water so the water which is uh, passing through these tubes after certain industrial processes they may need to go to the plant for recirculation or purification right and as it so bases which flow through this right so this all could be the reason for this type of corrosion all right